Welcome back to Bros and Shows. My name's Anthony. I'm Hunter. And we're back here with The Walking Dead. <laughs> I'm just as much in the dark with you guys as to how he's going to introduce us. So it's 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 fun for me. Too. So <laughs> I always just, I don't know what I'm doing <laughs> half the time. Uh, so last last episode was pretty wild. Yeah, so let, you want to recap that one for us? So we had a whole trial going on for mm-hmm. our, main, our man, uh, Randall. Randall. Mm-hmm. They were deciding what we we're going to do with this guy. We we're going to execute him. We we're going to let him go. Obviously, Dale was not about it. He was really hanging on to like us, like them, you know, keeping the old way of civilization. Yep. And Laws of morality. Yeah, yeah. But it's like, but everyone had a good point. It's like, well, it's all out there. No one's going to come help us if we're being attacked by them. We can't call the police. Right. Be like, hey, these people are hurting us. You know, no one's there for them. It's a new world. And it Dale, is. Dale couldn't accept it. He even yeah. said like. I don't want to live in a world that's Darwinism, survival of the fittest. And unfortunately for him, there's no choice. Yeah. Um, he's he's trying to just hang on way too much. Yeah. And then we got a loop oh, with. Yeah. Um, can't think of his name right now. Um, a loop? A loop with old boy. With uh, Herschel? Hersh- no, not Herschel. Uh, what, what do you mean a loop? Rick. Rick's little boy. Oh, Carl. Carl. Carl with, with Carl doing his little side quest with the zombie. Oh, oh. Yeah, oh. you know what I mean? I wasn't that, sure what you meant by loop. No, yeah, no. Yeah. So, but like Carl was like, he kind of was just in his own little mopey. I, I understand. Like, you're in a dystopian world and you're a kid. Like, you don't have a regular childhood like everyone else yeah. had. So, I can understand being depressed and everything, but he really was the cause for what later would be Dale's death. And then, even just the execution not even happening. Because he ran in on Rick at Yeah, doing I it. wouldn't exactly call it depression necessarily. What do you think but it is? I don't know. I mean, I, he's definitely sad that Sophia died, right? And that, that shook him. Yeah. Um, But I don't know. I don't think... Maybe, I think maybe this depressed, has been, yeah, I understand. I think this has been building up. The coldness inside of him yeah. has been building up. And finally, when he saw his dad about to shoot Randall, and he goes, do it, dad. You know, that flipped the switch in Rick. Like, what? Yeah, what that, we that was a right turn now? off for him for sure. So even if even if he, um, I don't know, I wonder if he was just trying to give that to Shane as like a win. You yeah, know? like he didn't really want to kill Randall, but Shane wanted it so bad and things have been so bad with Shane. Rick keeps winning that he's like, let me just throw him a bone here. Yeah, yeah, you, got, you and, got to. It, but then when Carl did that, I think it kind of like turned all that off. Like, no, we can't do this. We can't do this. We can't do this. Um, and even <laughs> even before even before Dale got killed, um. I think Rick had already come to that realization because the Carl thing happened before the, the Dale thing. Yeah. And then of course the Walker that killed Dale was set free by Carl yeah. going to the swamp. Yeah. Um, Lost the gun, went in and messed around with the Walker, didn't even kill him. And then it ended up wa- making its way back to the farm. That somehow was like a, I don't know if it was like a secret ops yeah. zombie Being because super silent. Yeah. Like, <laughs> <laughs> so the only like I, I don't mind the silence necessarily like they can you know walk without doing i guess whatever yeah. but the thing for me is like you're telling me that a, a walker was devouring like a cow and it stopped and it stopped to get up and meander around and then ambush dale that makes no sense yeah because oh uh, yeah right. yeah because we've seen the walkers literally when they're preoccupied with food they're right. gonna keep eating it if anything like make him go out there without his rifle and then, like, trip, and the walker, like, turns around and notices ah, him or something. Yeah. Like, yeah, that was just silly. But um, it's just, like, minor inconsistencies. But we're not going to ignore them. You know, like, Walking, Dead's a, up. Walking Dead's a great show. But it we're is. still going to bring up uh, the yes. things that we notice that are like, what? The show. You know, whether it's a writing issue or, like, a production <laughs> issue like that. Um, but, you know, we'll praise it when it gets praised. And we'll we'll tell it why it's done when it's done. Yeah. You know, uh, there's some writing. It's, it's usually writing decisions, if I'm being honest. Yeah. Um, but there's some continuity stuff. Uh, I'm kind of excited to watch this. We're going to do a double episode today, so it'll be 12 and 13. Um, I'm kind of excited to see what happens, and we'll see how the season two finale and penultimate episode go. Let's see cool. what happens. Nice old pickup truck. We got the Ot- four horse. Otis's truck. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, they're still reeling from Dale. Oh, absolutely. Dale could, could get under your skin. Yeah, he could. He should have got under mine. Because he wasn't afraid to say exactly what he thought. How he felt. Takes a brave person. That it does. That kind of honesty is rare. Especially when it's like against what everyone's saying. Exactly, yeah. And brave. Yep. Mm Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, Rick's done a 180. But between Dale Never and Carl. Make a decision. Mm -hmm. Checking the I fence line. Yep. Yeah, oh, he's you. fucked up, dude. <laughs> looking back at me with that look he had. I couldn't always read him, but he could read us. The perfect tracker right here. Literally, so <laughs> good. So useful. He knew things about us. The truth. Yeah, he could look at you and know what was going on. We he was really a sage are. like that. In the end, he was talking about losing our humanity. Got the rack pack he here about to handle business. Even that small group of walkers, if our group wasn't here, could have taken down Herschel's family. Oh, yeah. It's too many for them to take at once. Differences and pull together. From now on... The makeup's so good, man. It really is. Way. See, look, that proves my point. They were feasting on a cow and not move like no, yeah, they sorry. Were too, yeah. Yeah, no. And that was three of them doing it. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally like that scene from Office Space. They're attacking the printer. Oh uh, yeah, just start beating them. Beating them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they just Blew off some steam. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> With the swamp parking, the creek drying up. With 50 head of cattle on the property, we might as well be ringing the damn dinner bell. Yeah. She's right. We should have moved in a while ago. Fuck yeah, <laughs> Dale. Herschel? No, I mean, Herschel, shit. Near each of the doors, Herschel's turned into, the into quite the man. Down. Literally, he's done Green such a 180. Like, yeah. I love him now. He was being such a little bastard. Property. Now he's just like... <laughs> T -dub. You take the, the wake-up call he house. needed. Keep Absolutely. Everyone coming and going. What about standing guard? Well, I need you and Daryl on double duty. Gotcha. I'll stock the basement with food and water. Enough that we can all survive there a few days if need be. Dude, yeah. hell yeah. yeah. Herschel's killing it. First. After that, Shane will assign shifts while me and Daryl take Brandon Shane off here. Cut him loose. He'll be like, but Shane sleeps outside. <laughs> <laughs> Shane can have the barn. You know, the Dale's death and the prisoner, that's two huh. separate things, right? Yeah. I mean, it is two separate things, but what Rick's a good man. Wing, man. Be my guest. Thank you. You got it. Fuck Ooh, you, Shane. the tension's still there. Yeah, I thought he was going to change, but he's not. Look at him. Uh-oh. Andre. No way, man. <laughs> Why am I with Daryl? Help Herschel keep an eye on things around here. Maybe. Shane's got a way of letting things get out of hand, especially when he's all mm. torqued up. You want me to babysit Shane? Yep. I need to make sure every time I leave the farm, all hell doesn't break loose. Yeah. Maybe you should stop leaving. <laughs> oh my god. Shut up, an Andrea. Of course. He has to leave sometimes. So <laughs> like, or you, what are they gonna let you do it? You I don't left think too. So. You went to that town with, with Shane. Yeah. And, like, and then you guys did things like, on the attacked, road. You got attacked by walkers Shane? and then had sex in a car. Like, shut up. <laughs> you wander around by yourself. Oh, he went back and got the gun? I got off motorcycle. Ooh, if he finds out. I thought he didn't get it back when he dropped it. I, uh, I, I guess he went back and got it. I don't know. True. Damn. It's my fault that he died. God, why would you say that, man? He got bit by a walker. Why are you saying that? I saw that walker. I was going to shoot it. It's your fault. Say your fault. The wrong guy to tell. <laughs> Take this gun. <laughs> as long as I'm around you, nothing's going to happen to you, Carl, but I can't keep my eyes on you. He's just trying to stir trouble. <laughs> He's Carl, like, Carl, take this gun and do something stupid. Option, there you go. You got a knife. You'll be all right. At least he's taking responsibility and being like, I can't. I'm not responsible enough. Uh, Mom was right. Uh, Ooh, yeah, you're not getting out of there. Oh! He's trying. Probably shit his pants after last night. Yeah. Yeah, the men go in the 
in there. Now stay in there. Upstairs in my room. Oh! Go, go, go. I'm just gonna put my stuff over there. Oh! Ooh, why is he being icy? I don't know. I'd be like, all right, playing I'll hard see to you get. Up in a minute. Rick and Carl and I are taking the corner in the living room. You can put that in my room. You'll be more comfortable there. Hey! Yeah. He's such a good guy. Morning, child sleeping on the floor while I've got a bed to myself. This is still your house. What happened to him? I don't know. He like totally flip flop. I'll take the couch downstairs. On nights when I came home reeking of bourbon, my wife would lock the bedroom door. Sad to say that couch and I became old friends. Look, if you two can't and everything he says is so interesting now. Like yeah. I'm, I'm like waiting for every word. <laughs> Before you're like, just shut up, Herschel. Yeah, literally, literally. <laughs> the couch is mine. God, what's your plan with this one, Lori? Look at that She's look like, in her eyes. I, I need to stir some shit. Yeah, everything's going <laughs> too good. Literally. She's such a shit stirrer. Please come down. Are you trying to hammer those in metal? Literally, what's this? <laughs> I don't know. You let us out of Atlanta with no fault for yourself. Can you remember that night? The flames. And I'm sitting in your car thinking we're going to be all right. I think she She's means well. Be, right, well, get out of here. But, like, I don't know. And I never thanked you. <laughs> No, dude. Rick, in the last episode or two episodes ago, literally just tamped down the fucking flames that was Shane's craziness, and she is literally pouring lighter fluid all over it right now and striking a match. Hell yeah. She's reignited everything in him right now. Thank you. He's like, oh, there's so much. Oh, look at this. Look at this. He's like, oh my god, she just told me she loves me. Like, no, she didn't. Whatever happened between us, whatever Get the hell it was, and not just you, but. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Shane, please believe me. I am so sorry. <laughs> she, she literally can't leave him alone. Take him out oh, to snore an hour there, hour back, give or take. We may lose the light, but we'll be halfway home by then. This old pain in the ass will be a distant memory. Good riddance. I'm gonna take a piss. Let <laughs> yeah, me get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> hey, man, you seen Carl Lee? He's inside with his mother. Look, he came to me. For the first time in Cow two seasons. Right. Same thing, but... He was out in the swamps yesterday. He came across a walker, stuck in the mud, got scared, ran off. Same walker that killed Dale. That's the one. Ugh. I thought I'd ride out with Daryl. No, I don't trust you. Nah, I need you here. <laughs> oh, nice. You think I'll handle it right, huh? You didn't say that. What'd you say? Yeah, your son. Game of this. Just get that back you to tried to give it back to him. Freeing that prisoner. <laughs> More important to you than Carl. Fuck you, Shane. Oh! Uh, Dale told me that in these uh, old vehicles, the points get corroded. Screwdriver? Flathead. It's always a flathead. Mm. Remember when he told him that? Yeah. These two were the closest to Dale. Yep. I bet she's glad she sided with him before it all ended, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, yeah. That was that nice moment. Uh, with that. She's Give me a file. Let him down. 
Yeah, and he's probably guilty that he didn't. He was probably. He went against him. Maybe not in that moment, but overall. Oh, that's easy for you to say. You had his back. Oh, Glenn. Regrets, but I think that he knew how much we cared for him. Definitely. Yeah, so I guess in the beginning when Maggie said to sleep upstairs, I think he's just only thinking about the Dale thing. I forgot that that's probably weighing very, very heavily on him. Yeah. He's probably like, fuck this, I just need to be alone. Oh, yay, it started. <laughs> that must feel good. Mom said you'd be here. Told her I was taking the Got tired of helping around the house. Take it. Okay, all right. right. Trusted in him, huh? What happened to Dale? It had nothing to do with you. That's uh, just not true. Yeah. It's just not he true. Died, though. Yeah. That's why I need you. No more kid stuff. I wish you could have the child that I had, but that's not gonna happen. Yeah, you just gotta be real with yeah, them. Yeah, I mean, it's People not. gonna die. I'm gonna die. Mom. Gotta prepare him. It's gotta be no so hard for Carl to hear, though. For it. Yeah. I try to be, but I can't. Best we can do now is avoid it as long as we can. Keep one step ahead. It's true. I wish I had something better to say, something, something more profound. My father was good like that. You're pretty good too. Mm -hmm. I hope he knocks off the kid shit and just like starts to take it more seriously. No more throwing rocks at walkers and being yeah. skeevy. Oh god, that looks like it hurts so bad. Oh shit. It's about to happen. Oh, okay. Jeez. Yeah, you have no idea how much danger you're in right now. Dude, <laughs> he looks insane. Right? Yeah. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh, here we go! Oh, he's going to notice he's been working on the cuffs. He's done. Yo, Randy. Governor Carl, you're off the hook. What? Dude, Shane fucking probably let him escape. No, he took him? Oh, Dude, no. what, what'd Shane do with him? Go that way. Oh my god, what are you doing, Shane? Grab your group. You know where they're at? No, I don't. Okay. Where is it? Oh, Turn the lights up here. Oh, I need a shot of you getting out of these woods alive. You hear me? Now you start talking, boy, where are they at? We are. A camp set up off the highway, about five miles from here. Who knows if they're still there? Okay. okay. So you gonna take me too? What? Uh, because I, I'm just I'm done with this group, man. 
They do, but I want no part. That's all. Wow. So, He's bailing, huh? Yeah. You're not gonna kill me? Come on, man. If I was, you'd be dead. <laughs> Come on. Hey, you ain't gotta be so rough. We're on the same side now. You're gonna like it with us. Gets a little crazy sometimes, but it's a tough bunch of guys. He said with good. us. He's acting like it's still his group and yeah. like. Talk to more walk. I think he's just proven to Shane that he can't be trusted. My mouth when I get nervous. Oh no, dude! No way! No way! Ah. Yeah. <gasps> Snap his fucking neck, dude. Bro, he snapped his fucking neck. <gasps> He's gonna act like he got into a fight. Oh my god, you fucking. He literally killed the dude and then covered it up. Shay, I knew Shay was going full crazy though. I thought he was maybe gonna join him. As if you've got nothing to lose. Door was secured from the outside. That was a good little plan, though. That was a good little plan. Oh my god, dude. He's got. What's he using that for? I don't know. Saving it for later? Saying he lost his gun? Greg! Greg! Wow, dude. What happened? Wow. He's armed. He's got my gun. You okay? I'm fine, little bastard just snuck up on me, clocked me in the face. All right, Herschel, t dog get everybody back in the house. Glenn, Daryl, come with us. So, I feel like Glenn's gonna be able to he find, or Daryl's gonna be able to find it. That was the plan, wasn't it? Just let him the go. The plan was to cut him loose far away from here, not in our front step with a gun. Don't go out there, you all know what can happen. Get everybody back in the house. Lock all the doors. Stay put. Let's go. Dude, Rick is, or Shane has created yet another panic, right? Can you track him? No, I'll see nothing. Hey, look, there ain't no use in tracking him, okay? He went that way. We just need to pair it up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Bullshit, man. That's it. Kid wears a buck 25 soaking wet. Trying to tell us he got the jump on you? I say it right pretty much even so size, wouldn't you? All right, all right, knock it off. You and Glenn start heading up the right flank. Me and Shane will take the left. Remember. Daryl's not having yeah. a threat out there. Just keep an eye out for each other. I feel like Rick is wary right now. Yeah, he should be. So yeah. suspicious. It's like they're walking in tandem. That was Randall. That was Randall? Yeah. I didn't recognize him. I'm yeah. sorry. That no, was him? It's hard to recognize him sometimes when they turn him into walkers. That was Randall. That was Randall? That's yeah. why I didn't like connect it all. Yeah. So wait, wait, wait. They can turn... We'll talk about that. Okay. 
All right. Holy shit. I didn't start, gang. I didn't realize that was ran. I like, that's why he's looking at me all weird. Like, what? <laughs> I saw that, too. Uh-oh. Must have slipped through the rafters in the roof. Oh, God. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. He's got your back. So oh. This is where you plan to do it. Yeah. It's a good place to end it. At least I have the balls to call this what it is. Murder. You really believe if you walk back onto that farm alone, no me, no man, no hush up. You really believe they're gonna buy whatever bullshit story you cook up? Literally. It ain't no story. I saw that prisoner shoot you down. I snapped his neck. Oh yeah, you snapped his neck. It ain't gonna be easy. But Lori and Carl, they'll get over you. Oh my God, Whoa. he's delusional. I thought we worked this all out. We tried to kill each other, man. What you think? We just gonna forget about it all? We're gonna ride off under the sunset together? You gonna kill me in cold blood? Yeah. Sue my wife, have my children, my children call you daddy. Is that what you want? That life won't be worth a damn. I know you. Damn, because they've been friends for so long. Yep. This is poetic, dude. Look at this. It's like Romeo and Juliet shit going on here. I have no idea what I can live with, what I live with. We'll talk about what I can do, Rick. How about what you can do? Here I am. Come on, man. Raise your gun. I'm a better father than you, Rick. Oh! I'm better for Lord than you, man. Oh! I'm a better man than you, Rick, because I can be here and I'll fight for it. But you come back here and you just destroy everything. You're t so twisted. Yeah. Got a weak boy. Oh, oh what God. are you doing? He wanted he wants him to do it. Raise your gun. You're gonna have to kill an unarmed man. There is still a way back from this. Nothing has happened here. And we're gonna lay down our guns. We're gonna walk back to the farm. I don't think that can happen anymore. Put this all behind us. Look at that face. Dude, he's so crazy. Look at him. Yeah. Amazing acting, by the way. Yeah. John Bernthal and Andrew Lincoln. Wow. Oh! That was all just to get close. Oh my god. Yeah. This was you, not me! Not me! Not me! Oh, damn. That's the man you wanted him to be, right, Shane? Yep. Good acting. That's the end of Shane. Yep. <laughs> Fuck, man. That was so cinematic. Yeah. That, was, that whole thing was amazing. Dead? Oh, God. I need to explain this to Carl. Yeah. Oh. Oh! Oh, come on, dude. No way! It's not what it seems. Please. Damn, Carl, okay. I don't know how Rick didn't hear him coming. Yeah. Out. 
Just in shock? That's one hell of a shot, though. Oh, yeah, now, like... Oh, uh, they heard the gunshot. So, yeah. They just can change when they die? It doesn't matter if they got bit or not? So we're going to definitely break down that episode at the end of this one as well. But any quick thoughts on that? On what you wanted to talk about with them, like, changing without being bitten? That was So that just changes everything. So it doesn't matter if they get bit, if they die. So, like, is everyone infected then? Because, like, neither one of them were bitten by anybody or scratched. Or, you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't and, know. like, and then I was thinking maybe it was something they got contaminated with, like, on the farm. But then, oh, boy, was... Oh, at somewhere totally different, unless he was partaking the same like. Who are you talking about who's old boy? Uh, what's his name? I I'm so bad with names. Randall. Yeah. Randall. Like if unless Randall was like drinking, eating the same shit they were eating for a little bit from the farm that might have infected all of them. That when they died, then they turned. I don't know. It got a little confusing there. Yeah. So, so now that, that's the first instance we're gonna see of stuff like that. Where like, I mean, they, neither of them were bitten, but they turned. So yeah. The question is why. Yeah. You know. So I guess. We'll see what happens in Beside the Dying Fire. Let's jump right into episode 13 finale. Ah, oh, poor dog. Yeah. That helicopter that Rick saw. Yeah, that one helicopter had them all walk this far. Yeah, I think that's what they're getting at. Like, yeah. that, that one butterfly effect. Right, yeah. You know, set this whole horde in motion. Yeah. Yep. shows you how like one-on-one -on -one, they're not too bad but in a group like this oh yeah it's almost impossible yeah eventually brute force is gonna win yeah Took. Fuck, turn around. <laughs> Situational awareness. <laughs> we heard a shot. Okay, we think they found you. Randall. We found him. Was he back in the shed? It was a walker. Did you find the walker that bit him? No, the weird thing is, he wasn't bit. His neck was broke. So he fought back. The thing is, Shane and Randall's tracks were right on top of each other. And Shane ain't no tracker, so he didn't come up behind them. Well, they were together. Could you please get back out there and find Randall? Yeah, he'd have been screwed. If he killed Rick, he'd have been screwed. Yeah. He would have had to kill Daryl, Glenn, yeah. T-Dog, anybody who would have fought him against yeah. Herschel. You bit too? Probably everybody but Lori and Carl he would have killed. Mm -hmm. No. I believe that. Shane was... How did Shane die? Oh, he didn't see that. Okay. Dude, they're right behind you. How do you guys not see it's this dark. shit? It's dark. You, you gotta assume it's really, really dark for them. Oh, fuck. 
Oh my god. Damn! On. They're in the middle of a horde. I'll get the guns. If you just pass it to her on the highway, should we just go inside? Oh, this is a tunnel downstairs. I don't know about. I heard that size will rip the house down. <laughs> Carl's gone. What? He, he was upstairs. I can't find him anymore. You never watch your son. Mother of the year. <laughs> <laughs> country you pick up a thing or two. I got the number, there's no use. You can go if you want. Alright, Herschel's got nut up or shut up mentality. We have cars. Kill as many as we can. Alright. And we use the cars to lead the rest of them off the farm. Alright, here we go. You serious? This is my farm. I'll die here. Yeah, Herschel! It's a good night as any. Fuck yeah, Daryl. All right, it's game time. Where's my like? Bow, na, 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 yeah. now, da, na, na, down. <laughs> I need some music. Oh, he's gonna burn it down. Okay, hurry. Well, what about you? I'll be right there. Okay, it's a Zippo. Good. Alright, squad! Yeah, let's see what's about to go down. I'm excited. Yeah, this is action packed shit from start yeah. to finish right now. Crack shot, Daryl. Thank you, Daryl. God, he's so smart. Nice. Whoa. Oh, uh, dude, yeah, I knew that head? was happening. Why did he do I, that? I knew that was happening. Why did he do that? Bad way to go. There's no stopping this, dude. It's just too many. Fuck. It's all falling apart. It's literally like a final stand. Like a gangster though. Is happening. They're all going one by one. Oh my god, they just jumped on her, dude. Oh, Patricia, no. Let go. Oh, wow. Oh my god, I could not imagine that. Carol, come on. Better survival than that. She just got her ass saved by Andrea. Watch out! Look out behind you! Andrea's about to get caught finally! Oh. Oh my god. What? 
Get off the farm now. Don't say that. Reggie, it's lost. The others, we can't leave them. They're for themselves, too. What are you going to do? You get stuck in the mud, you're fucked. Yeah. Get off the farm. Herschel's still holding out. I know. Damn, that's an infinite, infinite ammo shotgun for sure. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Oh, hello. Where's Lori? Did you see Lori? I don't know what happened, Rick. They just keep coming. It's like a plague. They're everywhere. Lori, did you see her? Oh, we have to go. Find Mom and the others. It's my farm. Not anymore. Come on. Yeah, it's the Walker's farm now. I'm glad they didn't do the whole Captain Goes Down with his yeah, ship Yeah, me type too. Deal. Oh, oh, no. Oh, I don't like you, but I don't like you. That's terrible. Hey, that's a terrible way to go. Oh, she got that bag of guns. Nice. Damn, she literally got left behind. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Go get your girl. Oh my god, dude. She is so lucky that Daryl's here. Oh my god. She's like, thank you! Wow. This just shook up everything. Literally, in a matter of minutes, yeah. everything's over. I mean, that's how it works with those giant hordes. What are you supposed to do? But now imagine if Rick wasn't there. Oh, oh they would have I mean, been done. Yeah, you know? I'm sorry, Herschel. Belongs to the dead now. I wonder where, where they'll end up next. We've done our part. Time to leave. There goes the beautiful RV, too. Last you'll ever see of the yeah. RV. Did you see my dad? Did he make it? Did you see? Yeah, see, they've already had to do, deal with this kind of lifestyle. I don't know. You know, they've got to stay at the farm this entire time, so Jimmy, it's got to be a huge shock. They're gonna be on the road now. Yeah. Yeah. It's, strong. it's a possibility. All right, let's just circle around to the highway where we left supplies for Sophia. Yes, don't let her drive. She's in panic mode. Yeah, she's freaking out. Oh, which I understand. Yeah, no, totally. But don't, yeah, don't, you, it yeah. was smart to be like, yeah, let me just drive. Yeah. Brought to you by Hyundai. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, 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 look at me, look at me. Hey, we're alive. We made it. Good man. We gotta calm her down you. somehow. Yeah. Oh, he said oh, it. Yeah. Oh, what a great moment to say it. I should have said a long time ago, and it's been true for a long time. He always says the right thing. Yeah. I love Glenn. Okay. That's why Glenn's a solid number two man. Yep. I'll be all right. Yep, yep, Rick had the same exact idea. Well, well, where's Mom? You said she'd be here. Well, we gotta go back for her. Cool. No, well, why are we running? What are you doing? It, it, it's Mom. We need to get her and not, not be safe a mile away. You need to be quiet, all right? Please. Rick. Got to get your boy to safety. I'll wait here for my girls and the others. No, mm. don't split up. A few places. We'll meet up at some up later. We're we're safe. Yeah, numbers are we're safe. Not splitting up. Agreed. Thank you. Please. 
Keep your boy safe. I'll hide in one of the cars. If a walker gets me, so be it. He doesn't care anymore. I've lost my farm. I've lost my wife. Maybe my daughters. You don't know that. It's like everyone's giving up yeah. so fast. Be patient. And you don't know that. You're a man of God. Have some faith. Highway's definitely not safe, though. They can no. only stay here for so long. <sighs> Carl. It's not safe here. I'm sorry. You ain't gonna like that answer. <laughs> Oh, here's Daryl. Now he's like, okay. Right. They had that idea, the others will too. Oh. Oh! There's Glenn. And Maggie. Hey! And there's two. Alright. I love it when a plan comes together, man. That has got to be the yeah. best feeling for them. Yeah, like, just like a little, give us a little something. Having lost everything yeah. and now you gain a little bit back. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, got both his daughters. Still. Right. Where'd you find everyone? I'd be like, Carol, you mind if I drink Sophia's Gatorade? <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, Sophia's definitely not getting this, guys. Yeah. Wait, let's grab it. Where's the rest of us? We're the only ones who made it so far. Oh, Andrea hasn't shown up. So oh. She didn't have a vehicle, though. Shane's done. Of course she asked about Shane. Oh, uh, see? Yeah. She saved me, then I lost her. We saw her go down. Oh, uh, they think that the Pretty walker sure. falling on her was that it, her getting killed. Yeah. They got her too. Took her out from me. I was, I was holding on to her dad. She just. Oh. What about Jimmy? Did you see Jimmy? He was in the RV. He got overrun. Ugh. Damn. I'll be honest, I don't like Andrea, but she definitely didn't deserve no, all that. No, definitely not. She's annoying, but didn't deserve to be left behind. Yeah. But then again, she wasn't, like, intentionally left behind. Yeah, no. It was just the chaos of the moment. Damn it, Sophia. I didn't even remember you when I saw you. Yeah, literally. <laughs> oh, she got walkers on her ass still. Damn, they're moving pretty quick, bro. Yeah, I mean, shit. They, actually, you know what? Like, they, they're pretty fast in the beginning. I hadn't seen the show in... 10 plus years, so it's hard yeah. to like remember how fast they were when they were like new. But yeah, they don't get tired either. That's the thing. That's right. They'll yeah. never wear out. So as long as their like muscles and bones are still intact, yeah. they could like yeah. You just gotta get lose sight. They have to lose sight of you, so you have a kind of a chance basically. Right. And you're running low on ammo, girl. Damn it. I was just. Nice. Oh, you're getting yourself surrounded. Oh, she's fucked. Here. We can't all fit in one car. We'll have to make a run for some gas in the morning. Spend the night here? I'm freezing. We'll build a fire. Yeah? We'll be going looking for firewood. Where are you gonna? You don't, it's not like you're going home. Yeah. You don't have a home. How you doing on ammo? Not enough. Well, we can't just sit here with our asses hanging out. Watch your mouth. Everyone stop panicking. Listen to Rick. All right, we'll set up a parade hey. in the morning. Hell yeah, Herschel. Find gas and some supplies. We'll keep pushing on. Glenn and I can go make a run now, trying to scrounge up some gas. No, we stay together. God forbid something happens and people get stranded without a car. 
We'll find shelter somewhere. There's got to be a place. Rick, look around. Okay, there's walkers everywhere. They're, they're migrating or something. There's got to be a place. Not, not just where we hold up, but we fortify. Hunker down. Pull ourselves together. Build a life for each other. I know it's out there. We just have to find it. We'll make camp tonight over there. Get on there you the go. at the break of day. Got some walls. Got a little flowing water Should source. What if walkers come through or another group like Randall's? You know, I found Randall, right? He turned, but he wasn't bit. Yeah, you know too. Possible. Like, what the hell happened? Shame killed Randall. Just like he always wanted to. Yep. And then the herd got him? Time to talk. We're all infected. Oh, was that what the guy what? whispered to him in season one? Did you see? Jenner told me. Whatever well it done. is, we all carry it. So it activates once you die. And you never said anything? Well, it made a difference. You knew this whole time. How could I have known for sure? You saw how crazy that was. That is not your call. Okay, I, when I found out about the walkers in the barn, I told for the good of everyone. Well, I thought it best that people didn't know. Oh, shit. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh, he, he might as well. I killed Shane. He came at me. He killed Randall to get me into the woods. He planned it. Yeah. I had no, I had no choice. That's on you, Lori. You lit that yeah, fire. Yeah, you literally did. Oh! How could you possibly do that? Ew, ew, Lori! So just, eh! He just explained to you, Rick or Shane tried to kill him. He led him out there to kill him, and you're mad. Oh my God, Lori, way worse than Andrea. Yeah, Lori's way worse than Andrea. That is the. Get yourself a new lady, that Rick. That is the wrong reaction. Yeah, from, from that's a new look. He's like, I'm a new Rick now. You know I cannot mean? believe she is being like that. I can. She's it's like, Lori. you killed my boyfriend. I know. Oh my gosh. She's out of gas. Go, Andrea. You're doing great right yeah. now, honestly. She's come a long way from screaming every time a walker gets near her. Yeah. Oh! There it is. The sword you've been wanting for so long. Because swords are money. Look at her. She keep walker pets? What the hell? Who is this mysterious Xena the Princess Warrior-esque lady? Oh, you really? Now you're going to question him? Uh, yeah. Why do you need him? He's just going to pull you down. Ooh. Oh, now Carol's dissenting? Thank you, Daryl. Yeah. And I'm a burden. Oh! Shut the fuck up, Carol. What do you want? Yeah, what, what are you going to do? A man of honor? Yeah, honor. We need to leave. I mean, what are we waiting for? Which way? 
It came from over there. Back from where we came. Yeah. Leave where? The last thing we need is for everyone to be running off in the dark. We don't have the vehicles. No one's traveling on foot. Don't panic. I'm not. I'm not sitting here waiting for another herd to blow through. We need to move now. No one is going anywhere. Do something. I am doing something. Seriously, I'm shut the fuck up. Together, alive. I've been doing that all along, no matter what. I didn't ask for this. I killed my best friend for you people, for Christ's sake. Oh shit. You saw what he was like. How he uh. pushed me. Uh. How he compromised us. Oh. Uh. How he Rick, threatened you're... us. You're acting a little crazy now, though. He's not wrong. He's I mean, he's not wrong. He's just approach he about it. Put a bullet in my back. He gave me no choice. He can't always be like calm. Right? Yeah, I know. But he came after me. This is him unraveling right now, though. My hands are clean. Yep, I agree, hundred yeah. percent. And I agree with him. Maybe you people are better off without me. Go ahead. Literally, go. Yeah. I say there's a place for us, but maybe maybe it's just another pipe dream. Maybe maybe I'm fooling myself again. Well, wh why don't why don't you go and find out yourself? Send me a postcard. Go on. There's the door. You can do better. Let's see how far you get. Hell yeah. yeah. Tell him, Rick. All you want to do is bitch and moan and complain about what he's no doing, but none of you are doing fine. shit. We get one thing straight. You're staying. This isn't a democracy anymore. Ooh. It's a dictatorship. That's right. You want Shane? I'll give you Shane. Yeah. Oh, boy. Daryl and Herschel are his only supporters right now. Yeah. Not even his wife. She's mad about the Shane thing. Like, fuck you, Lori. Kidding me? What is that? Prison? I mean, that could be the fortress they're looking for. If they secure it and they get all the walkers out, it could be a great place to make a home base. Oh boy, we have officially finished season two of The Walking Dead. A lot happened from the start to the finish. It was nonstop, dude. So let's rack up our kill count. Randall. Sh Randall. Shane. Shane. Patricia. Patricia. Jimmy. Jimmy. <laughs> um, um who else anybody or were those our four deaths and then dale well dale was a couple episodes ago i'm talking about this i thought we were talking about the season oh no i was just talking about the last two episodes that we just watched in this reaction yeah um i think that was it just those four right yeah and then we we lose andrea yeah but she's all right some samurai lady savior which is pretty dope hell yeah finally got our samurai sword um I just have to talk about Lori and her insane reaction. <laughs> Rick literally broke it down for her. Like, this is what happened. He yeah. was going to kill me, so I killed him. And she's disgusted with him. Yeah. Like, she was obviously in love with Shane. She lit the fi the crazy fire in Shane again and made him do what he did to kill Rick. Yeah. Lori has quickly and unequivocally become the worst character in yeah. this whole show for me yeah she surpassed andrea andrea is actually like gained points for yeah, me. yeah for me andrea's at if anything she's she's off the top carol three. has yeah. lost points due to her reaction and her yeah. little brattiness uh maggie lost some points glenn lost some points the mm -hmm. only ones who gained points were andrea daryl and herschel herschel yeah herschel, herschel, gained the most points. herschel got in the top three for me yeah i mean yeah. i think i think my top three at this point rick daryl herschel it's gotta be Everyone else is kind of pissing me off a little bit right now. Um, even Glenn. Uh, yeah, Glenn means well. 
but yeah, he's he's just a lost kid right now, trying to figure out things. I feel like at times it's just the way he's treating Rick. Everyone, yeah. no one's no one's being grateful enough to Rick. He's the only reason that like everyone's surviving this far. Yeah, he's. You know? I mean, yeah, that. But it it what it has been the help of other people. Don't get me wrong, his leadership's definitely helped them. But yeah, once you get there's still got to be some kind of democracy. You know what I mean? I understand like when it comes to straight survival. But like, but you little... have to understand right now, they're not on the farm anymore. Oh, I know. They're not it... in a place where they have yeah. four walls and a roof. They're now out in the open. Yeah. He just was put in this situation where he's been nonstop like attacked, whether it be by Shane or by Lori or by the group for his decisions or by Herschel or whatever. Yeah. So now that like it's like you said, it's now just survival. So if you don't listen to one person who's making, there's no time for. Oh, for a I understand that, meeting, but like when they know? get back, because like if he's making it seem like that's how the demeanor is going to be the entire time. But if he's when they get to a fucking safe location, of course he needs to chill that oh, shit out oh, immediately. Totally. You're totally right. About yeah, that. like I but understand. Like there's only necessary. one leader. There's only one chief in in these open survival. Yeah, yep. you can't have a bunch of people yelling orders around. That's how people get killed. But like when it's in the calmer, like in the farm situation where you don't have to worry about that, yep. you can't be like. I totally agree. Yeah, like, but I think that this this if there's any time where he needs to be cutthroat and like make yeah, the decisions, I, I understand. Yeah, this I needs to be because everyone's panicking right now. They're trying to break the group up, and he's right. like, "Dude, no, we we literally were just there, and we just we got us all back together, and that was a miracle in itself that right. we were all able to come back together." Um, yeah, I thought that that was um like such a strong ending to that season yeah it was if good. you take us from like episode one of season two until episode 13 of season two it's a totally different show oh yeah you know like people evolved because oh and all the we haven't even talked about the fact that you die you come oh back yeah that's another thing like now you got like that was even thinking about that so even if people die of natural causes you have to like kill them you have to shoot them in the head or burn them yeah so immediately yeah, yeah it's it's a whole new ball game i mean whether you die from uh uh, you get you're getting hung, getting your neck snapped, getting bitten. You're always gonna turn unless you destroy the brain. Yeah. So like all your dead bodies now need to be, you know, buried with a hole in their head. Yeah. So it's actually kind of amazing that they that took them this long to figure out. It means nobody's died of any cause other than yeah. infection or being bitten up until this point. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, but it's just I don't I don't necessarily know if like that needed to be kept a secret. Especially, like, I don't know if it was... I feel like you shouldn't have, because just like we just said... Exactly. If someone just died of a natural cause, and they were, like, And Rick wasn't around. Yeah, and they were mourning it, and all of a sudden that person changed and bit them. You're like, what the fuck? Yeah, I agree. I think that that was definitely an oversight by Rick. I think in that instance, Glenn was right when he said it wasn't his call, and he should have been more forthcoming about that. Yeah, he's right. Um, But also, I mean, you got to listen to Rick right now. He's going to keep you alive. He's Mm going to try his best. And then maybe when you find civilization or safe haven again then we can chill out yeah we need to talk <laughs> we, we, need, we need him to be cutthroat right yeah um let me get your your top three i gave you mine what's your top three top three what people people of uh hates and likes yeah i want top three bottom three bottom three top three would be rick herschel and oh. daryl yep. yeah I mean, like you, yeah. To be yeah, honest, yours is just different order, but yeah, yeah. Cool. Um, and then, um, Mercury. and it just, just these last few episodes, how Herschel's been, like, just been amazing. So, such a good character. Yeah, like, and then I just love when people can admit their mistakes. Yeah, and then they grow from it, and they turn or just completely turn around. It's so dope. Yeah. Um, and the bottom three, top one would definitely be Lori, right? It's now. gotta be no question. Yeah. Number two is Shane for sure. He's dead now, so we don't have to worry about him. But this will like, be his last time on the list. Yeah, but like Shane really sucked. He went out with a real big bang at the end. I agree. And then um, the last one was probably Dale. And then like just because we didn't you go, can't put him on the list anymore. I know. Man. You gotta, you gotta I know. Somebody okay, else. Then um, yeah, Andrea. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, she still has some redeeming to do, but she was better in this episode. Yeah. You that's know? why she's on. She's made number three now. Okay. That's good. That's <laughs> cool. All right, guys. Well, thanks for joining us this far. Uh, if you have joined us this far, <laughs> check out some of our other content. Join our Discord if you have Discord. Um, look forward to season three. We're looking forward to watching it with you. Um, this is Bros and Shows. I'm Hunter. I'm Anthony. We'll catch you next time. Bye. Bye, little you. What the Bye-bye. <laughs>